New at noon, Rhode Island Hospital and Lifespan Cancer Researchers say they've made a major breakthrough in cancer treatment to fight glioblastoma, the most common and lethal form of brain cancer. 12 News reporter Dana Casulo joins us live from Rhode Island Hospital with those new details. Dana. Kate, well, this data shows this vaccine can expand the lives for people. This is what we know so far. A phase three clinical trial of the new cancer vaccine conducted at Lifespan Cancer Institute and other centers internationally has shown the vaccine extended the median survival rate of both newly diagnosed and recurrent glioblastoma, the most common and lethal form of brain cancer. In the phase three trial, the median survival rate for newly diagnosed patients increased to more than 22 months up from around 15 to 17 months without the vaccine and 13% of patients had a five year survival rate. Listen to this compared to around 5% for those who didn't get the new vaccine. This is the first time in nearly 20 years that a phase three trial of a systemic treatment has shown such survival extension in newly diagnosed GBM. Dr. Stephen Toms has been studying GBM for 35 years. This is what he had to say. And the nice thing about it is it's not toxic. Just like getting a vaccine for the flu or COVID that we're all familiar with, you get an injection a few times a month to start and then monthly for a few months. Um, and it seems to activate the patient's own immune cells to attack the cancer and reduce the chances of this malignancy coming back and killing a person. Mm -hmm. And doctors say there are high rates of glioblastoma here in the state. They see about 60 to 70 cases per year. Live in Providence, Cena Casulo, 12 News.